here to the back, one side to the front, back, front. I swear every girl has this debate. Hey guys, what's up? Welcome back to my channel. And if you are new, hello, my name is Javon. And thank you so much for clicking on my video today. So I am just gonna be filming a little get ready with me to film. I'm actually gonna be filming another video after I do this. So by the time you watch this one, that video will already be up. It's gonna be my pretty little thing favorites slash kind of like must haves, I guess you could say. I'm not sure what I'm gonna title it. But yeah, I just picked a few items from Pretty Little Thing in my closet that I just love and that I would highly recommend. But yeah, enough jabbering. If you would like to see how I got this look right here, then just keep on watching. And we're back me and my boat are back all right guys so I am about to get ready to actually film another video I'm going to be filming my pretty little thing favorites so I'm just gonna like pick a few of my like favorite items from my closet and kind of like show you guys like my you know like my staple pieces from them t-shirt appreciation moment how cute it's like a little tank top it says feed me tacos and tell me I'm pretty but anyway guys yeah so I'm just gonna go ahead and get started I am gonna show you guys like what I'm using I am gonna try to make this video shorter like way shorter than the last one I'm so sorry it was so long I just wasn't sure what I should cut out, what I should leave in, what you guys wanted to see, how much in depth you guys, you know, wanted me to go. But if you stayed and watched the whole thing, I appreciate you, you're a real one. So I'm just gonna first, oh, also by the way, before I even start, um, again, I already did my brows off camera, just concealed them with some concealer. I actually just used my MAC Studio Fix concealer today to conceal my brows and then I also use this to spot conceal my hyperpigmentation and just blended it in with this Morphe brush. I'm not sure the number, there's no number on this brush, but it's just like a little dense tapered brush. I'm just gonna spray my spray on. All right guys, so jumping straight into foundation, I'm actually gonna be mixing two foundations today. So first I'm going to go in with my Too Faced Born This Way foundation and I have mine in the shade Praline. And then I'm also going to mix in a little bit of this Hourglass Stick Foundation and I have this in the shade Warm Honey. So what I like to do with these is I go ahead and take my stick foundation which is almost empty like it doesn't even twist up anymore I've got to get another one. But I just swipe down like this on each side. I usually do about three stripes like on each side. I do one on my chin, one above my lip, down the bridge of my nose, and on my forehead. And then I'm going to go ahead and go in with my Too Faced foundation. And I'm just going to do one pump because a little bit of this actually goes long way I'm kind of like squeezing it out kind of slowly too because I don't need a lot and then I just do pretty much just like a dab like that and I'm just gonna go in and blend those two together all right looking good next I am going to go in with concealer and I'm going to use my Too Faced Born This Way concealer. So I'm just going to take that and I'm just going to apply it. I'm going to dot it under my eyes today. A little bit like that.
go back in and spray because I definitely need my makeup to last today since I'm technically doing like a two-in-one and I'm just gonna go straight in I'm not gonna let the concealer sit today I'm just gonna go straight in and blend it out Next, I'm gonna go in with my setting powder and I'm gonna do the same step that I did from my last video, but I, of course, am gonna show you guys. So first, I'm gonna go in with my Laura Mercier powder, just about that much. And I'm just gonna take a little bit on my sponge and I'm just going to actually just press this into my skin. I'm not gonna let it sit, I'm just gonna press it straight in just to set that concealer right away. So next I'm going to go in and bake a little bit under my eyes and probably down my T-zone as well. And I'm going to go in with my Huda Beauty powder. About that much, I am running low, very low. But I'm just going to take that on my beauty blender like that. And I'm just going to set it right under my eyes like that. And we're gonna let that sit while we move on to eyes. I'm trying to get a little bit closer. So for eyes today, I'm gonna go in with the Modern Renaissance Palette. So I'm gonna go in with the Morphe E27 brush and I'm gonna take the color Raw Sienna. And I'm just gonna dip that and apply it to my crease. Next, I'm gonna go in with the shade Real Gar, right here. And I'm also gonna take that on the same brush. Just gonna take a little bit, and I'm gonna also apply that in my crease as well to build it up just a little bit. So next, I'm gonna switch palettes just for a second. I'm gonna go in with my Tartlet All Matte Palette. And I'm gonna take the shade Dreamer. And I'm just gonna apply a little bit of that in my crease as well. Next, with that same Morphe M535 brush, I'm gonna go back into my Renaissance palette and I'm gonna grab the shade Cypress Umber. And I'm gonna apply a little bit of that and I'm just gonna apply it to my outer corner. Just like this. And be careful with this shade because it is really pigmented. So I just wanna apply it to the outer corner. And I'm just gonna darken this look up just a little bit. And I am gonna kind of bring it into my crease as well. Like just kind of fade it into my crease. Next, I'm gonna go in with the shade Tempra. And 
and I'm just gonna take that with a Morphe M433 and I'm just gonna take that on my lid right here where I didn't really have shadow and I'm just gonna pack that on it would really help to brighten up like the front of the eye Next, I'm gonna go in with warm taupe. And I'm just gonna use that to just blend everything together. So I'm just gonna take it and just work it in. Then I'm gonna go back in with tempera right here. And I'm actually taking this on a little Anastasia brush that usually comes with the palette. And I'm just gonna take the smaller side and just use that to highlight underneath my brow. I'm gonna go ahead and dust that powder away. I'm gonna go in with my Makeup Forever Matte Velvet Skin, and I have mine in the shade Y425. And I'm just gonna take a big fluffy brush and I'm just gonna use that to get my powder off. Next, I'm gonna go in with bronzer. I'm gonna take my Anastasia Beverly Hills powder bronzer and I have mine in the shade saddle I'm gonna use I just have another just like fluffy brush I also use this in my last video as well and I'm just gonna take a little bit of that and I'm just going to tap my bronzer into the areas that I want it Again, with that big fluffy brush just whatever's left on the brush I'm just gonna use that just to help blend the powder into everything well just to blend the bronzer into everything all right guys so moving back to the eyes I'm gonna take my soft glam palette and I'm just gonna use the shade Nior just this black shadow right here and I'm gonna take that on a morphe m158 brush and I'm just gonna use that to run it across the top of my lash line. For lashes, I'm gonna use my Too Faced Damn Girl Mascara, and I'm just going to apply that. And then I'm going to apply my lashes, and then I will be right back. Alright guys, I'm back with lashes, so I'm going to go ahead and do my lower lash line now, and I'm first going to take Raw Sienna again. And I'm going to take a little bit of that and apply it first. And I'm just going to run it across my lash line. And then I'm just going to go back in with warm taupe. And I'm just going to use that as well on top. Next, I'm gonna go back in with my Too Faced Damn Girl Mascara, and I'm just gonna use that to do my bottom lashes. For highlight, I'm gonna take my Dose of Colors highlight. This is from the Desi and Katie collection, and I have mine in the shade Fuego. And I'm going to take my Morphe M506 brush and I'm going to use that to highlight. 
So first I'm gonna highlight my inner corner of my eyes. And then I'm also gonna take that down the bridge of my nose. I'm also going to do the tip of my nose and then last I'm going to do my cupid's bow yeah. all right guys so for lips I'm going to do like a little combo so I'm first going to go in with my MAC lip liner. This is in the shade Cork. And I'm just going to line my lips with this. Next I'm going to go over that liner and then I'm also going to fill in my lips just a little bit with my NYX Suede Lip Liner. This is in the shade Sandstorm. I'm just going to go over that a little bit. And then for the middle or for the rest of my lips, I'm going to go in with my MAC and Aaliyah lipstick. This is from the Aaliyah collection that they came out with, I believe, a year. I know it's definitely been a year. I don't want to say two years, but I, it could be at least a year or two ago. And it's just this really beautiful nude shade. I'm just going to take that. I'm just going to apply it to my lips. I'm just going to finish off the look with my Tarte Setting Spray. And voila! Alright, so I'm just gonna go take off my lovely pink headband that I know you guys love. I'm gonna go take that off and fix my hair and then I will be right back. Alright guys, I'm back. I've straightened my hair and I changed my clothes so I can go ahead and get ready to film my next video. But I really hope you guys enjoyed this little get ready with me. But yeah, make sure you guys please leave a thumbs up on this video and if you are new don't forget to subscribe and I will catch you guys next week. Bye!